These nails is gonna scratch a bitch. Bitch, don't play with it. Don't play with it. watching Peyton in the background um today is Friday happy Friday you guys I am LaShante if you don't know welcome back to another vlog um if you are not subscribed if you like what you see I hope that you stick around and subscribe um follow me on Instagram because when I'm not on YouTube I'm on Instagram okay um so I curled my hair y'all Remember, if you watched last vlog, you know I told you I had something to tell y'all. Y'all my besties. Y'all know I'll be coming up. We, we, we here, right? I have been dating. Nothing serious, but um, yeah, I have been dating. And I am getting ready to actually go on a date. Uh, so I had curled my hair. I put these uh, tape-ins, not tape-ins, clip-ins. In and I just curled it but I, I'm gonna have to brush it out I haven't brushed it out yet but yeah so your girl is going on a date I don't even know how to act like I haven't been on a date in so long and it's just crazy like and I feel really really good I feel happy that I'm putting myself back out there um, instead of isolating myself um, if you know my journey you know you know if not go back and watch previous and previous vlogs but your girl is your girl is excited. She don't know how to act, okay? She don't know how to act. Like, what do you do on a date? Like, what do you do on a date? So, um, I'm just going to be myself. That's just what it's going to be. I'm going to be myself, my authentic self. I'm not going to let the past interrupt my future. I'm not going to let people stop Tay from being Tay, the loving, playful, cheerful Tay. I'm not going to let other people that affected me in the past change me. I'm going to be who I am. And, uh, yeah. So, with that being said, we're going to be getting ready. I'm not going to bring y'all along with me on the date just because, like, they don't know what I really do. They don't be knowing I be vlogging because I ain't put them up on that shit. Like, like it's just, um, and like I said, I'm dating. So, it's not just one person. It is multiple. What the I don't, don't want to say it like that because I don't want y'all thinking I'm, I'm, I'm a hoe out here. But basically, I'm just saying I'm keeping my options open. So, that's where we at. Um, I'm going to, like I said, I'm going to be doing my makeup. I'm going to get cute. So, yeah. The, um, the guy that I'm going on a date with want me to pick the location. Well, honestly, I don't mind picking where we go. Like, how do y'all feel about that? Like, do you want the man to plan everything out? I'm the type of person where if it's places I've been wanting to go, I'm going to tell you to take me there. So, like, I don't mind picking out the place. But, again, there goes my masculinity um, peeking through. Like, yeah, I'll take over. I'll do it. And when it comes to that, child, I'm, I'm trying to be in my feminine bag. I'm trying to be feminine dealing with these men. I don't want to be masculine. I want to be feminine. So, but he's like, yeah, I picked the place. And he's not from San Diego. So that's another thing. So he doesn't know too much, um, you know, too much going on around here. So I said, okay, I, I agree with it. I said, I'll pick the place. So what type of person are you on a first date? Are you like a type of person to where you want to go and sit with them and eat dinner and talk? Um, to be honest with me, I don't, I'm, I'm not that, I don't, I don't be on that type of time. Like, I don't want to go and get to know you at a dinner table first. Like, I want us to re do go out, do something chill, vibe. You know, like, get to really connect. And I feel like doing that at a dinner table is just not it, you know. Y'all let me know what y'all think. Um, I love dinner. Y'all know I love to go and eat. But, like, for a first date, 
I don't know. What do y'all think about that? Leave me a comment. Um, because I'm interested on what y'all think. Um, I definitely like romantic. But at the same time, I'm like, nigga, I need to know you. Who are you? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know, y'all. Let me know what y'all think. Any comments. But I'm excited. I'm a little nervous. But at the same time, I'm not. Because we have been talking, FaceTiming, getting to know one another. So I feel like I kind of got an idea of, you know. But this is going to be our first time seeing each other in person. So yeah, that's what we doing. Um, but how have y'all been? It's been so hot in San Diego. It's crazy. I've been drinking my water though. Y'all need to stay. You need to get on your Zoom. Drink your water, okay? I've been drinking my water. I'm actually about to put on a, uh, um, what you call this? You know, where you suck your, okay, y'all. Uh... So here's what it looks like. This is shapewear that I got from Amazon. Um, I think it does a pretty good job, like, you know. I think, I don't know, but if you guys are interested in this, I'll leave it linked below. What do you guys do to prepare and get ready for a date? Um, I was going to film a video because, child, I, I, I be doing a lot, okay? I ain't even going to hold you. You know, I, I got to get right, got to get tight, make sure I'm smelling good, lavender my body, shave, do, you know, get everything, get my hair nice and right, make sure everything's smelling good, you know. That's what I like to do before I go on a date. Get white in my teeth. Make sure my teeth look nice. Um, what else? It's a lot. And I really shouldn't be putting on a full face of makeup. Because it is so hot outside. But um, it should cool down more when we are about to leave. I don't know. I just want to get really dressed up. So we're going to put on a full face. Even though it's 90 degrees. Because who's going to check me? Nobody but the sun, okay? But it'd be nice when it's like um, nice and warm outside because your face be all looking nice and dewy. And then you guys, another thing, what I recommend for the summer, I highly recommend this one size setting spray by Patrick Starr because that is going to have your makeup sitting, especially when it's hot because it's waterproof. So make sure y'all go and invest in that, okay? Because I think it, it, everybody needs it. Everybody needs it that in a little situation okay i was gonna film a get ready with me but um i didn't really feel like it so i just figured i like incorporate it in the vlog so yeah y'all gonna get it in the vlog but anyways um i'm going to come back in a little bit because yeah i just wanted to introduce the vlog and talk to y'all about what's going on the update of my life whatever whatever so I'm going to be right back. Fingerprint, door lock, smart lock. Um, it'll also have a key as well, but like, I just feel like this is gonna add value to the house. The kitchen faucet is also gonna add value to the house because I got a really, really nice, like, um, like upgraded kitchen faucet because i showed y'all what the kitchen faucet was doing yeah, like i was just messing with the it was like a gasket piece of the kitchen faucet like the gasket was sticking out so i caught myself trying to like push it under and i don't know what happened baby but this track is is like really seeping through and it's kind of annoying me but what y'all think i'm gonna have to go through and recurl this part that's why i was showing y'all like this gotta be recurled, and I'm probably gonna spray some black spray right here to get that whiteness out. But besides this track trying to see through, other than that, it looks and then you see the little brown in there. Get into it, get into it. You see it a little bit over here, so period. Get into it, get into it. I'm trying to decide if I'm gonna put these nails on. I got some nails I want to put on. Let me show y'all the little um jumpsuit. The jumpsuit that I want to wear for tonight. Let's get dressed. Let's let me show y'all. We're gonna try her on and see what it's giving. <gasps> yeah, I need to put on some nails. Cause these nails is it's not it. Not it. Okay, anyways. Okay. 
Here it is. Here she is. And I need help zipping it up. I think it looks good. And then I was gonna wear it with, okay, I was gonna wear it with this white blazer, but I have to iron it, cause it's wrinkled. It's wrinkled. What were you thinking? Okay, this is a cute vibe. This is cute. I'm looking sophisticated. Like, are you gonna marry me tonight or what? Like, it's giving mom, boss lady, like, it's cute. But we need to go ahead and iron her and it needs to get button zipped up. Oh yeah, this is cute. And I'm gonna wear, I'm thinking these boots. Those, because I would wear these white ones, but I don't think it goes that well. Well, these are cute. Can y'all see? I gotta call somebody and see. Let me call my sister, hold on. Hi, but Okay, I got a question. What should you think will look? What should you think will look better? I did. That's not that bad. Hot pee. Okay. What you doing? Getting dressed. So this white. I don't know if you can see. This white. Um. It's like a. It's like a strap back around. A little bit more. Huh? Scoot back a little bit more. Okay. Or let me put on this one too. But this one is like a little strap. I need to iron this. I think the boot. The boot. Let's see. The boot is pulled up. Yes, it is. That's how it looks. The boot is giving. Is it giving body? Body, 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 body. Um. Look, this is this him. Oh, I like her. Yeah, I follow her too. Yeah. I'm thinking. I thought that's the vibe I'm getting. Okay, the black on black. Right. Yeah. Let me show y'all. She talking about Shayla. Yeah. I'm vlogging. Oh, you're vlogging? Yeah, that dress is cute. Yeah, it is. It's kind of similar to what you got on, but it's just not yeah. a dress. It's not a one piece. Yeah. So. Right. Hey, y'all. So, y'all seen I was just on the phone with my sister or whatever. And um, I'm putting on these nails that I found. These are stiletto nails. And I think they will go really cute with the outfit. Y'all see? Like, this is what it looked like. I hope I got enough nails. Because, y'all, if y'all see how many nails I got over here, you're going to be like, Tay. It's like 10, literally 10 nails over here. So, hopefully we have... Um, but, yeah. So, we decided to go with the all black look. These nails is going to scratch a bitch. Bitch, don't play with it. Don't play with it. Ooh, y'all, I don't think I'm gonna have enough nails. Okay, battery's finna die. Be back. Uh, how are you? Good, man. Oh, you're good. Thank you. I'm getting ready to go out. I thought you had to pick somebody up in the airport. Okay. Yeah, so I'm, I'm, I'm ready, so... Oh, I'm tired. Oh, you had to get ready. You said you tired. Yeah, I'm really tired. Oh, so you gonna go home and go to bed? No, I gotta go in the airport right now. Right, I'm saying when you get home. Mm, yeah, so I don't have any plans. So I wanna just. You wanna come with me? I want to come what you wear. Shit, I don't wear Huh? Wherever. Wherever you want to go with me. Well, I'm going out tonight. Yeah, you told me. Yeah, I know. So, <laughs> I'm going out with girls. I know. I know. Um, so, therefore, you're going to have to wait till tomorrow. What's up? 
So you're gonna have to wait till tomorrow. Oh, of course I know. I know. Yeah. Yeah. So I drive right now. So I'm just waiting for my sister. So I have to go with my sister. Which one should I go with me? Oh, you have to go with your sister. Yeah. So she's coming. She told me she's gonna be here in five minutes. Okay. Yeah. You look nice. Oh, thank you. Did you eat? Um, I ate earlier. I'm kind of hungry. No, you wanna eat again? Huh? Eat again? Well, I haven't ate. I haven't ate dinner. It's six o'clock, and I haven't ate dinner. I ate earlier. Oh okay. yeah. But I need to eat again because I haven't ate. But I probably should eat if we're gonna go drinking, because I don't want to be drinking on an empty stomach. So you gonna fuck that tonight? <laughs> <laughs> I wouldn't say fucked up because I gotta drive home, but uh. Oh, you're going to drive, so don't drink too much, you know. Yeah. Right, so I can't be, unless I get an Uber or a ride or something, but I don't know. We'll see. Of course, of course that's what I always do. If I know, like, I'm going to drink, like, I go somewhere, I always take, like, Uber or something, you know. I don't want to get trouble with police. Right. Or something like accident, something, you know. Yeah, I'm responsible, so I'm, you know. I'm pretty responsible, so I should be good. That's good. You, you, you know what? You, I know. I noticed something about you. Have you ever heard of dismissive? About what? Have you? Somebody ever told you you're dismissive? No. You know what that means? <laughs> no. What is? You don't know what that means? <laughs> no. So what do you think it means when somebody says you 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 seem dismissive? Tell me, explain it. It means like when somebody say something to you or ask you something, you like dismiss, like you don't pay attention to what they're saying. Really? What did you say? Our conversation earlier. About what? I was like, that's another little sneaky link. You know, and he already showing red flags. Talking, to, I told him he y'all heard y'all heard him. He um he a little dismissive. Okay, so I had to change the nails, you guys. So y'all seen me? I was putting these nails on the long stilettos, but it wasn't enough nails, so I had to change them to these. Oh, he got me that. Yeah, I had to change the nail because it wasn't enough. But don't look too close with these nails, bitch, because these nails, you mm, know. I don't know, but yeah, at least I found nails because I didn't want to go without nails. Anyways, I'll see y'all later. Bye. Y'all, it has been a change of plans. I, not really necessarily a change of plans. Um, why is my mom calling me again? Chill. Hold on. I can't hear you. Huh? Thank you. Yeah, I ended up changing my outfit. I ended up changing my outfit. I ended up changing my outfit. Why you change your outfit? I don't know, because I needed somebody to help me zip it up in the back, and I didn't have nobody. <laughs> y'all, did y'all hear her? She talked about she want to see the date. Like, I'm going to call you when I get there. I'm like, what? Like, my family is something else. Nonetheless, like I was telling you, you guys, change of plans. I ended up changing my outfit. One, because I'm so indecisive. Two, because I needed somebody to help me zip it up in the back, and I ain't have nobody to help me zip it up in the back. And three is because I want it to be more like chill vibe slash cute vibe. I'll try to get a picture or get show y'all when I get uh, to the place that I'm going. But yeah, I ended up changing, so that's the, that's that. Um, yeah. Who is hot, y'all? So I'm sweating. I don't want to turn on the AC because if I turn on the AC, you won't be able to hear me talking and. Um, yeah, it's not. It's gonna be a waste of footage. Cause I did that last time, 
and you guys cannot hear me at all so i do not want to turn on the ac while i'm talking to y'all so with that being said i'm gonna have to call y'all back because it's hot and i gotta roll these windows down so i i see y'all i see y'all in a minute I got too many Like two thousand years later. Good morning, you guys. Um, it is the next day. Um, the date went really well. Had a good time. He was really, really uh, a good. He was a good, a gentleman. Really nice man. Um, yeah, so I enjoyed myself. I'm actually going out again, going on another date tonight. So I'm outside. Period. Your girl is outside, y'all. I don't know how to feel. I told y'all I don't know how. It's a hot. It's a hot girl summer. Okay. Um. But yeah, the date was really, really good. Oh. It just shows you that it is people out there who will do nice things for you and take you out and want you to have a good time. So, my hair looking crazy, y'all. Still got it in a little ponytail or whatever, but um, I look crazy. Don't mind. I still got to get wash my face properly, um, you know, get myself cleaned up. Cause like I said, I'm actually going out on another date tonight. So, yeah, that's what we'll be doing. I also need to get air in my tire because it says the tire pressure is low. So I need to add air. So that's what we gotta do. Let's go and add air. Ooh, I'm gonna chop up. Hey y'all, I am back at it, motherfucking again. Back at it, getting right, getting tight. Um. I think the last thing y'all see me in the car, I was going to go get some coffee. Yeah. Um, so I've been chilling, just chilling all day. I haven't done anything really. Um, wait, this not even plugged up, y'all. This is not even plugged up. So like I was saying, I think the last time y'all see me, I was going to go get coffee. It is so hot. Like it's making me feel sick. But yeah, I'm back at it again with a motherfucking, back at it and motherfucking again. If you haven't subscribed, make sure y'all subscribe because I'm on the road to a thousand subscribers and I would love for y'all to join me in my journey. And um, so, yeah, if you like my content, if you like me, I swear I'm a, a fun, nice, genuine person, then go ahead and subscribe. Um, yeah, I'm recurling my hair because it needs to be recurled. Yeah, I was saying it's so hot. Like, it's just making me sick. So I was, like, going to curl my hair in the bathroom. But it's so fucking hot in that bathroom. I just said, hell no. You know what? Matter of fact, I'm going to turn on the AC. I'm, I'm tired of this shit. I'm going to turn on the AC. I want to learn how to curl my hair with the, the barrel uh, curling iron. But, um... I like, I think the wand is just like much easier. So, y'all, I'm not gonna lie. Putting myself out there and dating again is making me so happy. And, and, and not necessarily for like talking to or the guys or being with people or being taken out. But it's just the fact that I am um, not letting my past trauma, you know, hold me back from potentially meeting my husband. And not saying I'm trying to out here find a husband and, you know, all that be so in tune to just try to find love again. I'm not even on that. It's just like, you know, putting yourself out there, having fun and, you know, being me and being young. Like, I'm not, you know, so I'm just, that's the, the part that I'm happy about and not letting, because, you know, y'all be watching me. Y'all know I can be really closed off and shield myself and just focus on me and that's that and that be that. So I'm just really proud of myself and I'm happy. I'm like really happy. Um, so if you guys um, are anything like me and you feel like 
You want to put yourself out there. The devil wants you to be isolated. Don't isolate yourself, girl. Only isolate yourself if you, you know, you feel like you need to be alone. And you know, as a woman, you know when you like, okay, let me just take some time for myself. Fuck everybody. You know the feeling. But if you don't have that feeling and it's just because, you know, go out, do you, baby girl. Go have fun. Let these niggas take you out, spend some money on you. You know, you work hard. Go out, have fun. Do you, so... And then also when dating, don't have so many, don't expect for things to go right. Because you're going to be, as you're dating, you're going to be weaning out all the fuck niggas. So don't expect every nigga you talk to to be the one. You know, have your options open and talk to different people. So that way when one fuck nigga fucking up, you have another one on the roster. You know what I mean? Because these niggas, you know, they don't. They don't be having it all together. And a lot of them um, say they want a relationship but don't really be wanting a relationship. And which is fine. But you know, you're know you going to know how to wing them out. So don't be caught up on trying to find that one the first time, the first week, the first month of dating and stuff like that. Just have fun. Just have fun. I don't know what I'm wearing. But y'all going to see what I'm wearing. Um, I told y'all yesterday I ended up changing my outfit because I ain't have nobody to help zip it up for me. <laughs> Anyways, I'll be back. I shall be back. Okay. Okay, y'all. So I wanted to come on camera and do like a little prep. Um, what I like to do also when I'm prepping. So I like to mix lotions. So I like to use like a smell good lotion and a regular lotion and mix the two. That way I won't use so much of this. And I'll use just mix the two because I just want the smell. And this is just regular moisturizing lotion. This one is the vanilla, the wrap vanilla body lotion uh, by Bath and Body Works. So what I do is just mix the two, put a little bit of this, a little bit of that. And girl, your body is going to be smelling good all night. If you want him kissing on you, girl, use a smell good lotion and mix your regular lotion and also, of course, you're going to be putting on your um, your perfumes and stuff. But you want this to stick. Also, what I like to do, smelling good, you know, if you want to go mess with your little sneaky link, I would say like around the private area, put baby lotion um, or put some lotion like around it, not obviously inside, but like around it. So if you go down there, girl, you know... <laughs> He, he, you gonna be smelling right. Okay, y'all. This is what I got on. I'm gonna cut a split in the shirt. Y'all have seen this shirt before. I got this shirt from Shein. Um, it is a long, oversized t-shirt. Yeah, I would say it's oversized, but I'm gonna cut it. Um, I did um, tie it. Okay, y'all. Look, this one I'm wearing. Um, if you knew how many times I switched my outfit, you would be like, Tay, why the fuck would you change so many times? I changed so many times. Because I didn't know what to wear. So, I decided to be casual. Cute casual. With the holter top. Zara jeans. Fashion over bag. Nikes. Um, let me give y'all a better look. And the mirror. You probably really can't see. But here's me. You better look in the bathroom. Cause they're probably be better in the bathroom. Let me show. Give y'all. So this is the vibe for tonight. So yeah, necklaces, 
jewelry, same old same. Um, these earrings, I think these are from Forever 21. This is little studs. And again, like I said, my Nikes. Yeah. So, thank you guys for watching. I think I'm going to end this video here. I think I'm just going to make this one its own video. Like, get ready with me to go on some dates. I don't know what I'm going to call it. But y'all will see. So, thank y'all for watching. Um, if you guys have any advice on dating tips, on anything y'all, any advice y'all want to give me, tell me to look out for. Girl, put it in the comments. Let's chat it up. Because we besties. We here. We Y'all, y'all. if you watch me, you know, you know. Um yeah so don't forget to subscribe again i'm telling y'all i'm trying to get to the thousand subscribers subscribe leave me some comments share the video because that helps me oh and also like the video because that helps me too i notice it helps my engagement so please y'all um but yeah y'all will see how this the day goes in the next vlog i love y'all stay safe and bye guys